There's the lineup then, Glatzer of Australia, Van Velthoven of New Zealand, Kenny of Great Britain and Levy of Germany. Three laps of the track to decide who will take the fifth place in the World Championship in the sprint. This is the final race of a packed schedule tonight. Van Velthoven there in the black. We've got used to seeing him uh, race over the last few days. There is Maximilian Levy being held up. Alongside him, the new world Kieran champion, Jason Kenny. And on the inside, the Australian rider, Glatzer. Three laps of the track, uh, not normally any uh, too many uh, bits of tactics go on here. Four riders on the track, big guys. It's normally a pretty rapid uh, sprint. And it's Glatzer who's at the front. Kenny is in second. He looks down at uh, his pedals. He's just seen uh, his girlfriend, Laura Trott, win that elimination race. Van Velthoven right on the wheel. Who's going to go around the outside is going to be Maximilian Levy. The bell goes for the last lap. And it's still the Australian rider, Glatzer, who uh, is going to move inside the sprinters line there Kenny goes through the middle but the Australian rider takes it 10.537 a very respectable 68.3 kilometers an hour magnificent performance there by Glatzer to take fifth place in the world championship men's sprints It's fifth place, but it means everything to these riders. They've fought their way through a really tough competition, and to finish fifth in the world in a world championships is uh, all important. Job well done, and they never ever give an inch, do they? So he's going to just spin those legs over, undo the uh, straps on the shoes. Here's the result then of the fifth to eighth places. Matthew Glatzer takes fifth. Maximilian Levy will take sixth. Jason Kenny in seventh. And Simon Van Velthoven in eighth place.